Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Nick Push. Thank you for stopping by the only place on YouTube where we talk Halloween ends. <laughs> Kidding, obviously. Uh, it's everywhere, right? Um, but I do want to thank you for stopping by my channel. Appreciate you guys uh, giving me a chance to entertain you, to talk about Halloween ends. It's fun for me. It's fun to see you guys interacting in the chats. Um, I enjoy it, so thank you. Tonight, I want you guys to do me a little favor. I want you to close your eyes. Do it, close your eyes. We're gonna do a little exercise here, okay? So are your eyes closed? I bet they're closed. Or you're already tuning out and going to the next channel and unsubbing. But, humor me, close those eyes. I want you to picture this with me. It is Halloween night, 2022, in Haddonfield, Illinois. Murders have happened once again. Man, it's Halloween. Happens all the time, right? You got Lori Strode and Allison Strode gearing up. Gearing up for battle once again with Michael Audrey Myers. They're gearing up. People are dead all over the place, right? If your eyes are closed right now, you can picture the streets ahead and field. You can see wind blowing, trick-or-treaters scampering home in fear, especially after what happened four years earlier, right? Lori's amping up. And all of a sudden, you hear breathing. It's the shape. We're in, his, we're, we're, we're in a POV sh shot of the shape, right? POV shot. He's walking up the stairs, just like we saw in the trailer. He opens the door. Lori's waiting with a gun. She shoots. Misses. The shape and Lori, they're battling. They are battling it out, okay? He's throwing her everywhere across the room. She's kicking him in the nuts like she did the doctor at the hospital in Halloween Kills. They are just battling. Allison's in the backyard, um, you know, trying to trying to get back in. She can't. Um, all kinds of chaos is ensuing. Lori finally stabs him in the hand. Michael's laying down. She's like, fuck this. I am ripping his mask off. I want to see his face. I want to see his eyes when I kill him, when I slit his fucking throat. She takes the mask off. Oh, fuck. It's not him. It's Corey Cunningham. What the fuck? What the fuck is going on? In her shock, Corey gets the upper, upper hand, throws her down. He's standing over the top of her with a knife about to stab her. And all of a sudden, boom! The door is kicked open. It's the real shape, the real Michael Myers. And all of a sudden, the soundtrack changes from the Halloween theme, and we hear Enrique Iglesias. I can be a hero, baby. I'm not saying anymore. But boom, Michael Myers just fucking brutally kills Corey Cunningham. Just fucking rips him to shreds, guts him like a fish, as Ghostface would say. Him and Lori embrace. The town of Haddonfield gathers outside of Lori's house. They give him a round of applause. Michael Myers is the hero of Halloween Ends. Cut to black. <laughs> I'm having fun right now, right? Like I said, I probably lost a lot of subs to this bullshit. But I just want to have some fun tonight, guys. But an aspect of that could happen, right? Probably not the Enrique song. All kinds of different things could happen, scenarios could happen, but Michael could theoretically save Lori from Corey, right? You know, you see it all the time in movies. There's, in, especially with an imposter, you know, the imposter's impersonating someone, obviously, and the person they're impersonating comes and doesn't like that they're impersonating them, kills them. Now, Michael's not going to embrace Lori. He's fucking evil, right? But it is possible that Michael could have a little moment a little heroic moment. What do you guys think about that in the chat? Do you think, A, it'll happen? Remember, not exactly like I said. We know that ain't going to happen. I don't think. Um, will it happen? And B, would you like if something like that happened? Maybe not, like I said, my exact scenario, but something where, you know, Corey's doing all this damage to people, impersonating the shape, and the shape shows up. And tell, I'll tell you what, if the shape shows up and sees Cordy doing that shit, as much as people as Cordy might have killed and shit, 
I kind of feel bad for the guy because Michael will brutal make his kill brutal, like Cameron brutal. But that's my thought, guys, tonight. The shape could have a heroic role, in a manner of speaking, in Halloween Ends. Obviously, you know, I'm just having some fun with it. But would you like if there was a moment like that where he sees Cordy doing some damage and brutally kills him? You know, he's not going to be doing it to save Lori's life he, or Allison's life or whoever it is. You know, um, he would most likely kill Cordy and then try to kill that other person, obviously. But there could be a moment like that. And I want to know what you guys would think about that. Um, thanks for watching. As always, guys, thanks for humoring me. Don't cancel me for singing. Uh, please don't unsub, but if you do, that's okay too, because I might as well. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.